Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you guys are having an amazing day today. But in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best money methods to do this week in GTA 5 Online. Now, regardless if you have everything in the game or if you have nothing in the game, you're going to be making lots of money doing these money methods. And trust me, you guys will enjoy today's video. But before getting into this video, and if you are a new viewer here to my YouTube channel, make sure you guys do me that favor. Hit that subscribe button if you guys aren't subscribed already. I do upload the best daily GTA 5 Online videos. But other than all that talking guys, let's get straight into today's video. Now getting into this first method, you're going to want to go over to the adversary mode section, go to hunting pack remix, and you're going to want to start up hunting pack remix one. Well, that's just the one that I recommend. The other ones suck in my opinion. Hunting pack remix one is the best one. To start that up, once you start it up, make sure you guys put the team balancing to on. And I recommend putting first to win to five rounds because that's how you get the most money. And yeah, if you do not know what this game mode is about, it's basically, let me think, how can I explain this? So it's basically a team of scramjets. You can see just me and my team of scramjets. So it's 4v4 and we're basically going over to another team which are vigilantes and those vigilantes are defending a tall van and basically what we have to do is this right here we have to literally knock over the van and make him explode and the vigilantes are obviously defending him but our goal is to basically blow him up and yeah that's basically the goal of this game mode it's very very fun if you guys were on my stream last night comment down below it was very fun doing this game mode with you guys but yeah this is actually how much money you guys will get at the end of the game which is actually a lot of money for a fun game mode so take a look right here match winner we actually got 68 thousand dollars but i'm gonna show another clip because i actually ended up getting more money in another game that i actually ran so I'll take a look this how much we made sixty-eight thousand dollars and seven thousand rp now that last game mode that i showed you guys was only a total of seven rounds and take a look at this clip right here this was eight rounds total and we got literally 20 more thousand dollars you can see we have eighty-four thousand dollars for that one just for running a whole other round so the more rounds you guys get the more money you guys could get into this next money method, you're going to want to go to stunt races and go to transform races, start up any single one. I recommend setting the race type to non-contact, but that's completely your choice. And set the number of laps to 7 so you guys get the max amount of money. And for destroy last place, I recommend putting it anywhere from 15 to 30, anywhere around there so it makes the race go by fast. And you guys will get the most amount of money doing this as well. But yeah, if you guys don't know what transform races are, it's pretty straightforward. You basically transform into a whole bunch of different things in a race. See right here, I'm a car. And then once you come over here to like the transform thing, boom, you turn into like a Fagio, which I know. Fagio suck, but this race is actually very fun. It's probably one of my favorite maps to do. I think it's called the Dragon if you guys want to try it out for yourself. You can see you go from a car to a Fagio to a plane, and then you go to like, I think it's a Wagner, but I didn't put that clip in here. And right now I'm going to show you guys how much money you guys could get for a winning first place. Shout out to the guy during my stream last night who actually let me get first place so I could show you guys how much you actually get from it. And yeah, I forgot his thing. I forgot his name. Yo, comment down below if you were the one who let me who let me win first place last night in the stream because I really wanted to show you guys how much you guys get for first place. But take a look. After like almost 15 minutes, is how much money you guys get for 15 minutes of racing. And keep in mind, it's very fun. So take a look. First place, and we got seventy thousand dollars which is very good and take a look at this rp guys it's insane 20,000 rp and that's like literally four bars for me if you are lower level than me which i'm level like almost 700 so you might be lower level than me you guys will probably get way more rp than that and take a look there's another race that we did right here it was only four minutes long and this transform race that was four minutes long gave me 21,000 rp now that's insane 21,000 rp for four minutes racing make sure you guys take advantage of transform races as much as possible but yeah, into this next money method is going to be the time trial for this week. As you guys can see, it's going to be located right here on the map. You can go ahead and pause the video. It's over here like the Vinewood sign. And I recommend doing this with a very fast bike like a Shataro like me. And once you're here, make sure you guys go ahead and knock that fence off. Because it's very important because we're going to have to go through that here in a second. But yeah, go over to the time trial. And what you're going to want to do is start it up. Now press the pause menu and go mark where the actual waypoint is because it doesn't actually give you a waypoint when you start it so it's going to help us out. Then just quit the time trial race and once you start, once you quit the race, uh, you're just going to want to start it right back up just like so. Take a look right here, I just clicked it to start it back up and take this exact route that I take. So come right down here, come in between like the W right here where the, where the like the W letter is. Just go right through there and take, take this exact route that I'm taking. Not really too much explaining to do. If you guys do this race by yourself or the time trial by yourself, you will know what to do. And yeah, just basically pretty straightforward from here. Just follow the exact route that it tells you to go to with that waypoint. And it sh you should beat it as long as you do that first part at the very beginning uh, perfect. You should be able to beat it. And once you beat it, once again, you guys will get $102,000, which is a very good amount of money for only 1 minute and 40 seconds of racing. It's $102,000, and you guys shouldn't have a problem with this as long as you follow the exact method I told you. Now into this next money method is going to be the RC Bandito time trial for this week. It's going to be 1 minute 50 seconds long, and it's going to be located at this construction site where I'm going to show you guys right now, right here on the map. 
So make your way over here. Obviously, we'll need to own a RC Bandito to actually do this. But yeah, start it up just like so. And once you start it up, you're, you're simply just going to want to do it. This is really straightforward. Honestly, this week's RC Bandito time trial, not very many tips for it. Just be consistent. You know, if you crash a couple times, it's fine. And yeah, the only real tips that I always give, you know, the normal tips that I always give, just take your time and don't crash. You could be, you could even be slow, and if you, as long as you're slow and don't crash, you should be able to beat it. Take a look, I beat it on my first try, and you get $100, $1,000 for doing it just like that. So, very easy, you guys can get $200,000 for doing both of those races. Let's go on to the next money method. For this next money method, you're going to want to go to the mission section and start up the Los Santos Connection. Take a look, it's right here, it's called the Los Santos Connection. This one pays you a lot of money and I recommend putting it on hard just like you can see on your screen right now. We put on hard and you guys can also start up whatever mission you want. This is just the one that pays you the most in my opinion. Also, when you start the mission, make sure you guys put a stopwatch for 15 minutes because you want to make sure you're in this mission for exactly 15 minutes so we get the max amount of payout. But yeah, this one's pretty easy, you guys can see, uh, we just take out a whole bunch of people and you can also pick up water of cash on the ground with, from those like crate things and they give you like a thousand dollars per crate so that's on top of the money you're getting from this mission i think you can get like around six thousand dollars extra just from those crates and also i recommend when you actually start this mission up and you get like once you finish the hack part that i was just uh, showing in the last clip come over here make sure you guys have this plane right here blown up you can see my friend already blew it up and yeah once you're in the mission for 15 minutes then go ahead and finish the mission but make sure it's been 15 minutes very important it has to be 15 minutes and once you beat the mission, take a look, this is how much money you guys will end up getting. So we got around $53,000, which is pretty good, not too bad. And for the RP, you guys can see we got 7,000 RP. And yeah, that's it for all the money methods that are the best to do this week in GTA 5 Line. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did go on to enjoy today's video, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It is free and you can always change your mind. And also drop a like if you haven't already. But that's it for today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.